How to use the licensing management system to apply for an employee license with the Massachusetts Gaming Commission. This guide is for gaming employees and key gaming employees. Congratulations on your job offer from a Massachusetts casino. Before beginning work, every gaming and key gaming employee must be licensed by the Massachusetts Gaming Commission. This guide will walk you through that process. Step 1. Visit MassGaming.com from a computer, smartphone, or tablet and select the Employee Licensing button. Follow the links to the Licensing Management System. Select Create User Account. You will be asked to create a username and password and to submit an email address. You will receive an activation email. Follow the link in the email and sign back into the Licensing Management System with the username and password you just created. Step 2. Submit an application. When asked to select application type, choose the category that applies to you. Then select which casino has offered you the job and the title of the position. Next, you will be asked to enter personal information. If you have served in the United States Armed Forces, please upload your DD Form 214 when prompted to do so. You may be required to upload additional documents, so be sure to have the following on hand. Any bankruptcy discharge information if applicable. And if you are a key gaming employee, we will need a 4506T form from the IRS and copies of your five most recent years of tax returns. As you complete the application, you have the option of saving your work and coming back at a later time. You can then complete the application form by downloading the PDF to your device completing it, and then uploading the completed application back to the system. When completing the application, be accurate and truthful. The application must be signed under the pains and penalties of perjury. Untruthful or misleading answers may, and in some cases must, lead to denial or revocation of your license. Read each question carefully before answering, and answer each question completely. If a question is not applicable to you, choose NA. We ask questions regarding civil, criminal, and investigatory history that go well beyond what your potential employer is allowed to view. You must answer these questions completely, but you do not need to share this history with your potential employer. If you are unclear on a question, contact your HR representative. However, do not contact HR concerning criminal history. Instead, contact the Massachusetts Gaming Commission at 617-979-8473 or employeelicensing.mgc at state.ma.us. Once your application is complete, you can sign it digitally and submit it. We will then review your application. If we need additional information, we will contact you at the email you provided when you created your account. Step 3. Submit your fingerprints. When your application is deemed complete, a fingerprinting appointment will be scheduled for you. When you appear for fingerprinting, please bring identification. You will need the following. Either a valid passport or a valid state-issued ID like a driver's license and a certified birth certificate. Step 4. After you have submitted your fingerprints, your application will be submitted to the Commission's Investigations and Enforcement Bureau to determine your suitability to receive a license. Investigators may reach out to you for additional information or clarification. Once the investigation is complete, the Commission will either issue your license or in some cases may deny your application for licensure. If you are licensed, you will receive an email notification and you will be able to retrieve your license certificate from your account. At this point, you are eligible to work at a casino. Thank you for taking the time to learn about our licensing process.